what's going on YouTube thank you for tuning in to another video of mine Kev Scooter Motor Vlogs we are on the 150cc Ice Bear Hawkeye I'm on my journey back home now every Thursday I end up going up here picking up my medication it's about 18 miles away from my my home so I'm halfway home already I got like maybe another 9 to 10 miles to go but yeah, I hope you guys enjoy this here ride. I really don't got a topic on mine or anything, but um, I'll let you guys soak in the ride for what it is. Enjoy, you guys. Beautiful sunrise over there, guys. One thing I like about riding hell early in the mornings like this, we got the most beautiful sunrises. This is one of my favorite spots to ride across. Isn't that sight just beautiful? I think so. this light never turns for me so I'm gonna go ahead and play this smart normally I would go sit right there by myself and then I would have to reverse my scooter and then come this way and go back around so I'm just gonna get it over with there's no cars yeah there was a car behind me he would have turned the light but oh well I'm already here let's do it well it looks like we might be going to the freeway you guys Let's just go to the freeway. Heck with it. I'll get off the next intersection. this morning man Nice little run. Where are we at now, Falker? Boy, I cut some. Uh, I made. I made up for some time lost. That's good. I was a little bit behind schedule, so it looks like I just caught up on schedule right now <laughs> by doing that freeway run. What I like about sometimes getting on the freeway for just one, for if you get off, one, if you get on at one intersect or one uh, on ramp, and then you get off at the very next one, it's good to open up your scooter like that. Now to stay on there full throttle for at least ten minutes or more, I don't think that's too good. But under five minutes, give it a good old full throttle, wide open does some good I think well Nelly here comes this diesel I think I'm gonna turn right but you know what back over here sorry for my, my driving this morning guys I don't recommend for anybody to be riding the way I've been doing right now that was a no-no 
I wasn't way against uh, breaking the rules, but it's not the way I'm used to riding. I never like to hop in and out on ends like that. Let's see, I'm doing, I might as well slow down a little bit before I get a ticket out here. the girl I wave hi they see that's where it's messed up man what I believe is whenever a stranger like myself I just told that lady hi she just ignored me I don't know if you guys can see it but she just automatically took it like maybe I'm a pervert or I don't know it's really hard to say but normally I always think if somebody tells you hi the right thing to do would be to say hi back you know one friendly gesture gets you know another friendly gesture but some people don't believe in that, man. Some people would just totally shine you on in a rude way. I don't take it to heart. It's just somebody else must have done something similar that ruined it, you know, for innocent guys like myself. Or you, you know. I tell you the truth, it feels good stopping right here. My body's starting to warm up. The legs are hella cold. Today is September 29th, 2021, and I believe we're going to have an early fall, early winter, man. Still on full. I remember I filled up before I left, and it was, yeah, I filled up, and it's still on full. We already got like 20-something miles behind us. Actually, 30-something miles. We're getting some road uh, road repairs done. That's hella good. I love it when I see uh, people repairing the road like this, the city. We have a lot of messed up roads here. They're starting to get repaired though. Oh damn, I'm riding in the bike lane. Yeah, this is my exit right here. There's our DMV right there. I gotta go there tomorrow.
actually this wasn't the road that I was looking for it's actually one more down to the left but I want to try to yeah I'm gonna stick here I'm already on this road anyhow come on light there we go yeah I was the groundskeeper for this hospital right here big old hospital all the surroundings even all the offices over there I remember this uh, all the hedging and everything right here in the front would take me from uh, early in the morning all the way until lunch break like maybe 10 11 45 no more than 12 then I would have a mow day Thursday would be just on the mower all day it's a sit, sit down mower so I don't mind but sometimes you get sore man you get tired of sitting down now what I really don't like doing is hedging hedging all day all day long make your arms sore If anybody has uh, anything in mind that will help keeping your help prevent your uh, your visor from fogging up in the in the winter, please drop me a comment, man, and a link to what I could buy or something. Cause I'm I've tried this here spray and it didn't work, man. But I know that there's things out there, and then there's the, there's also uh, certain kind of hacks or you know somebody. I mean, on YouTube, I. I see how some person did a potato, cut a potato, rub a potato on there, and then they won't. I ain't trying to do all that. I was hoping they had something like a film that you unpeel it and you stick it on, stick it on your visor, and it won't fog up. Something of that sort. It'd be nice if they had like a USB clear thing that you know stayed charged up for so long or something battery battery operated that you push a button and it turns a little warm. But yeah, don't see that happen either. I don't know, maybe there is something like that. <laughs> 